Hey guys, so uh, I wanted to check out the official Android 5.1.1 update here for the Xperia Z2. Uh, you knew it was coming because this is one of my favourite devices of all time. And uh, I have just installed this update, so you can see some things are still updating in the background. Uh, this is based upon the build number 546, and I will leave a link in the description uh, if you want to check it out, it is available to download now. Uh, and uh, as you can see, we do have uh, this new kind of uh, front interface like you saw in the Z3 uh, Compact. And also we do have slightly different icons uh, in the settings here, which uh, are a little bit cleaner. Uh, and also uh, you're getting uh, the increased uh, customizations here. Uh, in terms of the uh, volume controls uh, so you can go a little bit more uh, intricate if it will let me there we go uh, so you can uh, really uh, customize this area a little bit more which is quite nice uh, you also get the uh, LinkedIn integration uh, apparently I don't use LinkedIn myself but those of you who do use that uh, will enjoy being able to set up uh, appointments uh, and then it will sync uh, to your LinkedIn calendar, which is quite nice. Uh, and uh, apparently gets the same updates to the uh, camera app as well. Uh, it should uh, improve the low light capability, uh, as well as the firing speed. Uh, which I've never been that uh, disappointed actually when it comes to the Z2 in terms of the camera. I think that uh, it's always been a fantastic uh, shooter. But nevertheless, this update will improve things a little bit more here and uh, give a little bit better performance when in the superior auto mode. Uh, and in terms of the actual other things, such as the uh, multi-user support, we can just have a look at that. Because I did get some lag now and again with the uh, the... Z3 compact, so we just want to make sure this is working as it should be because Android 5.0.2 is quite stable actually, uh, not had uh, any issues with it really. So, you can just have a look here. A white could be allowed to change that. What's that? Let's put it. Trying to do a video over here. Talk about aggressive advertising. That's better. So, uh, is this loaded yet? Uh, don't want to do that. want to get into it, just want to check it out, don't want to sign up my life away. I wish that one day that we could just get to the point where it's just one screen and that's it and you, you, you pass that and then there's no further things to do. Wouldn't that be awesome? Uh, so you can see we do have a new profile here uh, which is all working as it should be and it looks like uh, everything's updating as well so you can just switch back to my profile uh, this is a German ROM by the way hence why you might see some German here and there uh, but I think the uh, localized versions will be coming quite quick as well. So uh, I did do a benchmark uh, speed test with this to check out the performance you can see. Uh, we're getting 41,435 here. Now I'm not sure how that stacks up compared to the uh, previous score, but I will leave a link 
or sh should I say a uh, comparison in the description uh, for those who are interested in that. Uh, in terms of the actual speed, it feels a little bit snappier here and there. Uh, the Z2 is a very nice and fast device nevertheless, uh, but now and again I did notice it does uh, feel a little, a little less so uh, responsive than it used to. Uh, because I think it's the uh, Snapdragon 801 uh, and it's clocked slightly uh, less obviously compared to the more recent uh, um, processors so uh, you can see we do get the access to the quick Wi-Fi settings which is nice and Bluetooth so that's all in there uh, you do also get uh, enhanced smartware integration for those of you who have gone out and bought you know your smart uh, wear like your smart watches and things like that you can use it as a remote selfie uh, button so that's pretty cool and you also get enhanced uh, business support uh, which is uh, coming with one of the business uh, features I think uh, although I've yet to actually find the particular app so I can't actually show you that uh, at the moment, but it sounds pretty cool nevertheless. And we do have this life log as well. I did actually try using this at one point, but to me it's a bit creepy because it kind of just like, uh, it tracks everything, like, and it's a bit annoying. You know, it's like uh, Google coming out with this new thing which tracks where you've been over the last three years. I think it goes a bit far if you ask me. But for those of you into your fitness, this is pretty cool. Uh, and uh, it's quite equivalent to your S Health and things like that. So definitely worth checking out here. Uh, and uh, I think uh, that's about it really in terms of the main changes I don't think there's many uh, new apps for example and uh, you still get access to like this nice weather app here and don't think there's any major changes when it comes to the music player either you can see in here uh, you get uh, the same kind of audio settings which are really nice and intricate here but not a huge difference really so you can see we still get this here uh, so still an awesome device here the Xperia Z2 and uh, definitely consider giving it a touch up here oh that's nice it's updated everything now that I've logged into the life log you can see here uh, that is pretty nice uh, I might start using it actually because of that but yeah so uh, just a quick little video here checking out the official Android 5.1.1 update for the Xperia Z2 hope you did enjoy and if you did leave a like and I will see you in the next one cheers